So I just found this insane AI tool that can build entire working apps for you in minutes. Apps that are totally ready to sell with their own user databases, user logins, backend analytics, you gotta check this out. So this is something that I just built and only took me a few minutes to create. And this is a fully functional app and website. I can click on any of these buttons and actually use everything in here. So let me show you exactly how I built this. All right, so this is a tool right here. It's called Lumi. Now they are the sponsor of today's video. So if you wanna follow along with me as I show you how to use this, make sure to click the first link in the description down below. With that link, you will be able to join and you'll even get some free credits just for signing up. Now, when you first log in, you're gonna see this really clean looking interface like this. Up here at the top is the prompt box. This is where you're just gonna type in exactly what you wanna build with everyday language, no technical stuff required at all. And there are a couple settings in here as well, which I will show you how to use later. But overall, that is it. it is a super clean, very minimal interface that allows you to stay focused on actually building something. Now, if you scroll down, you're gonna see this community section right here. These are real apps that people have built with Lumi and have shared with the community. And you, you can use any of these to get an idea of what you can build with Lumi and to get inspired. So for instance, let's go ahead and look at this hotel booking website. Look how beautiful that is. There's a nice moving video in the background, a nice headline right here. All these buttons actually work. So here are all the different hotel rooms that you can book. There's a gallery button up here that shows you all the photos of the hotel as well. So this isn't just like a surface level, looks looks nice website. This is an actual website that actually works. And people can use this to actually book hotel rooms. Let's look at another example right here. This one is called Market Pulse. And this one shows real-time information about different stocks. So we have Apple stock over the last month week, day, we have Microsoft stock, same thing. All these buttons work. We see the global markets here on the right. We see different currencies, we see different portfolios. So this is a very robust website that was completely created with Lumi. And the best part is if you like any of these projects, you can remix them. And that means you can take someone else's working app or website and make it your own. But before I show you how to do that, let's create something from scratch. All right, so for this first example, I'm going to create a client appointment booking system. This is something a ton of local businesses need. Hair salons, think yoga studios, consultants, personal trainers, they all need a way for clients to book appointments online with them. So I'm gonna come over here to the prompt box and I'm going to type in, create an appointment booking system for a local business. Include a calendar view, ability for clients to book available time slots, and a way for the business owner to manage bookings. Then I will open up the toolbox and I will make sure that of all the tools that I want selected. What this is going to do is it's going to make sure that my final product has some sort of structured database, has a way for users to log in so they can actually book appointments, have analytics that I can view on the back end, and so that when people actually book, they'll get an email letting them know that their appointment has been created. So I'll make sure all those are checked off. In addition to that, I'm also gonna come into the styling section. Now you don't need to use this, but this will ensure that the website or app that you're creating looks exactly the way that you want with the styling that you want. Now for this one, I really like this style right here. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on use this one. But if you want to preview any of them, you can use this preview button, take a look at what the website, generally the style will look like. And if you're happy with it, go ahead and click on use. And then all you have to do is click on submit and sit back and let it get to work. So here we can see that Lumi is beginning the work. On the left here, it's describing exactly what it's doing while it is creating our website for us. So it says it's going to create a comprehensive appointment booking system with the calendar view using Nordic minimalist design principles. And here's every step that it's going through as it's putting this together. And in a moment, we'll be able to see what our website actually looks like. And look at this, within just a few minutes, we have a fully functional booking system. This isn't just a static page. This is a website with buttons that actually work. I can click on any of these calendar buttons or any of the buttons, actually be able to navigate to different parts of the website, book appointments, all of this actually works. So let me show you everything that this new website does. So I'm gonna click up here where it says open preview in new tab. This will allow me to get a preview of what it looks like and check this out. So our website is called Nordic Wellness Studio. 
Now, because I didn't give Lumi a name for this website, that is what it chose, but you could tell it exactly what the name of your business is or the business that you're building a website for. Then you can come over here. If you want to book an appointment, you can go ahead and click on book appointment. You can see all the different services that are available. You can choose any of them, enter in your name, address, phone number, select a date and time that's available and actually book an appointment. And you can see that even after you book the appointment, you can easily reschedule and you also will get a confirmation letting you know when your appointment is. Returning back to the homepage, you could also view the calendar right here to see what days and times different appointments are available. And you can come down here and find out more about the services and the company values. Again, any of this can be changed. So when I gave it the original prompt, I didn't give it very much information, but I could have told it the name of the business, what the core values are, what the different services are that we're offering, and it would have included any of that. But since I didn't do that originally, what I can now do is I can come over here to this text box and tell it to change anything. I could tell it, hey, change the name of this website to Paul's Wellness Studio instead. And I could tell it what hours we have open, say, oh, we're not open nine to six, we're actually open nine to seven, make those changes. And we don't offer consultation, so eliminate that service and replace it with, with something else that we do, right? Any changes that you want, you can just put in here and it will make those for you. But if there's any small changes that I wanna make quickly, all you have to do is click up here where it says visual edits and you can change anything that you want. So I can click right here and I can change the words. So maybe instead of Nordic Wellness Studio, I want it to be called Nordic Wellness Experience, right? I could change the font size, maybe make it smaller if I wanted to. I'm not sure why you would want to do that, but you could do that. You could change the color of it. So if I wanted to make this uh, like a gray color right here, or even a red color, any, any changes like that you want to make, you can easily do with this visual edit function. Now, I don't like those changes that I made. I think that the AI did a much better job than I did. So I'm going to click right here where it says discard, go ahead and discard. So we go back to the original design. All right, so once you have the website or app exactly the way that you like or exactly the way that the client that you're making it for likes it, you can go ahead and deploy it. And Lumi actually makes this very simple. So if we click over here on the top right where it says publish, you can go ahead and actually publish this right away with one of Lumi's domains right here. Now, if you wanted to, you can also add a custom domain, which obviously if you're doing that for a client, that's probably the way you want to do it. But for a quick deployment, you can just click on publish. And here's the link to my new website right here. So I'll go ahead and click on that. That will then open it up in a new tab. And this is a link that I can send to anyone and they can start using my website and booking appointments with me. So they'll be able to come in here, like click on hairstyling, book now, and actually book an appointment. And because Lumi is developing a Stripe integration, you'll soon be able to receive payments for anything you build in Lumi as well. And here's something else that's important. Let's say you build something in Lumi, but your client has their own developers who want to customize it further, or maybe they want to put it on their own website outside of Lumi. Well, you can use the export button right here to actually export everything save it to your desktop, send it to the client, and then they're gonna be able to use it on their own website and tweak it however they want, which means that you are never locked in to Lumi's ecosystem. Now, Lumi has one additional feature that I think makes it really stand out because it's so unique. So let me show you what's happening behind the scenes of my new website. So let's say people start coming to my website, they start booking appointments. Well, I can come into Lumi click on workspace and get all of the analytics for my new website or app. So for instance, I can see right here that I've had one visitor, that's myself. That person has visited once, they've looked at my website twice. I can see what the bounce rate is. In other words, how many people visit the website and don't actually book anything. And on average, how long people spend on my website. Now, I was the only person who visited it but the more people that visit it, the more data you're going to have and it's gonna be available to you inside of this analytics area. And I can break this down by the last 24 hours, only today, last week, last seven days, last month or 90 days, whatever you want. In addition to that, I can click where it says user and see all of the people who have booked appointments with me. So here's the only person who is myself, there's my email address, and I can see that the time that they actually signed up. I can also see additional data in here, like all of the different appointments. So here's an appointment for myself that I just created 
for tomorrow. And here's some mock appointments as well that I threw in here just so you can see what this looks like. And there's a lot of other features over here on the left as well, like email service. You can see the entire source code for your website as well. And the authentication system, that's already set up as well. People can create accounts, log in, reset their password. All that stuff usually takes forever to set up if you've done it yourself or you, you need to do it yourself. And this is what separates Lumi from just another website builder. This is actual app development without the coding. Now, before we make something else with Lumi, if you're getting value from this video and enjoy learning about tools that could help you start a business, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. I'm constantly testing new AI tools and figuring out practical ways to actually use them. So if you don't wanna miss out on that, definitely subscribe. All right, let's build something else so I can show you what else you can do with Lumi. So in this case, I wanna build a task management system that small teams can use. So watch how fast this is. I'm going to tell it to create a task management app where team members can add tasks, assign them to people, set due dates, and mark them as complete. It should be called the task app, and users can create up to 10 tasks per day on the free plan, but then they will need to pay for the premium plan. Uh, also add a page that goes over pricing as well. Now under toolbox, I'll make sure that all of these are selected so that on the back end we get all those analytics that I showed you before. And in addition to that, I'm going to choose a different styling for this one. Let's kind of go with a, let's take a look at this one, the sketch. This is really cool looking. I'm gonna go with this one. So I'll go ahead and use that style. And then I will click on submit. And boom, look at that. In literally minutes, I have a working task management system. So here it is, it says the task app up here, team collaboration made simple. Welcome to the task app. I love that little animation where you hover over it and it just kind of wiggles a little bit. Organize your team's work with hand-drawn style task management system. You know, I didn't tell it to you put all that in there, but it's filling in all of this extra copy because it wants to make the website look as nice as possible. So what I can do is I will now click on login to get started, or you can click up here. Let's take a look at the pricing page. I'll click on that. I see $0 for the free plan and $19 a month for the premium plan. This is exactly what I wanted. We can come over here to the dashboard as well and click on login. And here now we are logged into the task app. It looks so nice. Up here is a nice, personalized welcome message. Here it tells you how many free tasks you have for the day, how many tasks you have total, how many you've completed, how many are in progress, how many are overdue. Like this is really cool. This is highly professional. This is something that people would actually pay for access to. Coming here to one of the tasks, I can go ahead and complete it. I can rewrite any of them to get it exactly the way that I want. I can delete any of them. All of this works. Here's a new task. All of this works. This is a fully functional app created in a matter of minutes with just plain text. It is so cool. But again, let's say there's something I don't love in here. I, I'm struggling to find something I don't like, but let's say I wanted to make this green button red. Well, again, I can click on this, or actually I can click up here where it says visual edits. Go ahead and click on this and go ahead and change the color. Or if I was lazy and didn't feel like doing that, I could just come in here and actually tell it what modifications to make. So I can say, change this button to red and click on submit. And then it'll actually do that for me. And because I specifically pointed out what I wanna change, it's gonna know exactly which button I'm referring to. And there we go, you can see the button is now red. It is that easy. So let's talk about some realistic ways you could use this tool to potentially make money. Now look, I can't promise you're gonna make any money with this. Starting any business is hard and there's never any guarantee. But these are legitimate services that people are already offering that you could use as inspiration. So first of all, you could offer custom website development to local businesses. So for instance, right here, someone spun up this very professional looking website that offers website construction services. So think about businesses in your area that need simple tools or websites, like a yoga studio that might need a class booking system, or a consultant who needs a client portal, restaurants that need online ordering systems. That's where you can come in. You can build them a working solution in minutes and charge for it. 
And that's really easy to do because of the remix tool. So for instance, if we come back here, let's find another one. So let's take a look at this real estate one right here. Here it is. Let's say you really like this one and you want to reach out to local real estate agents in your area and tell them, hey, I can build you a beautiful looking website that has all of your property listings on it, as well as information about all of them and how people can contact you. And then once you have a client, all you have to do is click right down here where it says remix and you're gonna be able to make something very similar without having to start from scratch. Because what it does is it loads up that website and you can tell it what changes you wanna to make to tailor it to your client. So I can tell it, hey, instead of Real Estate Pro, let's go ahead and give the name of the real estate agent. Maybe his name is Paul Lipsky, it could change it to that. I can change the background image right here to an image of a home that the real estate agent I'm working with is actually selling along with the other properties as well. And if they wanted to change any text in here, tell it again in plain English exactly what you want in this box and it's gonna be able to make those changes for you. And here's another way you could potentially make money with Lumi. So I'm here on this website, you see on the bottom right, this was created by Lumi. Now this doesn't look like much right here, but what this actually is, is an iOS app. And that's actually available to download already on the App Store. This is it right here. What this does is when you download it, you can record your voice and then play it in reverse. So it's kind of a fun app to use. And this was created by Lumi, deployed to the iOS store. And you can see right here, it is free, but it does have in-app purchases. And this was already rated by over 23,000 users. I truly believe that this is like a golden era for AI entrepreneurs. Tools like this one let people do the work of five developers. Even if you just try it out, you might create your first app that can actually make some money. So if you wanna try out Lumi for yourself, click the first link in the description down below. With that link, again, you're gonna get free credits just for signing up. And I also wanted to let you know that they're actually running a hackathon right now from November 13th through November 30th, where you can get 100 free credits just for participating. And if you share what you build on X, you could potentially win up to $1,000. If you wanna participate in that and learn more about it, make sure to join their official Discord, which I'll also have linked up down below. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.